Alright guys, so today I have a um, the new generation Xbox One controller with Bluetooth um, plugged into a Brook adapter um, for the Wii U and Nintendo Switch and the firmware is up to date and this is plugged into a battery bank and as you can see I've got it paired with the uh, Nintendo Switch and it's working fabulously um, and so a lot of um, people have posted about that you need to plug this into the dock but that's not true at all um, all this little, um, all this Brook adapter needs is power, so you can use your controller totally wirelessly from the Switch um, because it, the connection goes on Bluetooth. Um, but this adapter is just here because it needs obviously uh, five volts from um, from some power. So um, if you ever want to play wirelessly, like you're on a plane or I don't know, it's a bit of a clumsy setup. You you don't really want to have to take this whole thing with you. You may as well just buy a Pro controller, but it's a cool thing nonetheless, um, and the Pro, you know, the Xbox One controller is pretty comfortable, um, and I've already got one of those around, but this adapter was pretty expensive, almost the same price as maybe a Pro controller anyway, so, yeah, all in all, it's a good setup, but I just wanted to show you that um, you can do it wirelessly, there's nothing holding you back, you just need to provide this adapter with 5 volts, and you're good to go.